Hey guys, Crux here. Today we're going to be over in Eastern Puglands, which I believe is a first. Um, but we're going to be in Tyr's hand, uh, just farming these elites. Uh, obviously in the hopes of a higher chance at greens, blues, obviously epics, uh, rune cloth, um, just some venerable grays, and just obviously the raw silver as well. So... <laughs> Uh, my gear is going to be right around the same of what it's always been, or as what it's always been. Uh, I actually just got rid of all the attack speed. I thought it was going to be a lot better, uh, more useful than it proved to be. So I went with uh, 7 agility. So my spell power is around 361. Uh, I might actually go with this just for the spell power um, so I can consecrate and murder them a little bit more. And I actually might just go full defensive for around 61% damage mitigation. I got my druid with me today. Uh, I would not be able to do this alone. I've had a lot of issues with mobs going to my druid because uh, they just heal so much. So I'm going to give salvation. Hopefully they are okay on mana. Let's obviously drink my Sabre Delight. Repot up completely. I think I just wasted that pot. Yeah, I did. Do -do -do. I'm actually going to use my Midsummer Sausage. Yeah, okay, I'm at 441 spell power right now. Just the most I've ever had. So enough talking, more farming. If you guys ever hear the sound cut out, it's because I'm on my druid. A kitten. I might actually just go drill borer. Block value is pretty important. Yeah, let's do that. Let's just run straight through. Clerics are okay. The spell binders are not. I don't like those guys. Warders are okay. Actually, warders are what I want to farm. Let's find out if they're up. Ooh. Looks like they don't. I actually farmed this place way in the past, and I just didn't like how the video shot, mainly because I couldn't do it easily. I had a lot of trouble, actually. These guys do cast Holy Strike and stuff, just like the Paladins in Western Bloodlands. I'm pretty sure they run, too, so I'm just gonna go inside. Oh, boy. I gotta go for it. I need more Dragon Breath rocks. Do they not run? Oh my god. Yo, if they don't run, this might just be one of the best farms. Eh. Wrong one. Oh my god, I can't believe they don't run. That makes this so much easier than the Hearthclan farm. I have an idea. Sheen of Zanza has a 3% chance to reflect the first expensive spell cast against the user. Let's try it out. So, yeah, about like 10 to 20 silver a pop. And that's split between my druids, so it's like 20 to 40 silver a kill. That's pretty damn good. Let's get some mana. Those spellbinders hurt so bad. They're called enchanters here. Whoa, we need to reset this. Okay, still ordered. Oh! Oh. Oh no. These guys actually don't hit nearly as hard as the people or the paladins do in WPL. This is crazy. What's really nice about this, once you get inside here, you can kind of just keep farming it. And you can, you actually can farm this solo. Oh my gosh, I almost freaked out. What I like about this is that these greens are going to be level 50 and above, which is Illusion Dust and Greater Eternal Essences. Oh my gosh, that's three cleric. I kind of want to grab more enchanters and clerics. Ooh, there's something down here. Ooh. Well, that wasn't worth it. Okay, here we go.
Just a death sleep. Let's go. Oh yeah. All right. So far, these guys are dropping some pretty good stuff. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, a bulky mall, a balanced war axe, primed musket. These all sell for over a gold. It's like two gold. Like a gold 80. It's just a flat gold. 50 silver. That's 80 silver. This is nice. Wow. We'll find out what's upstairs. Is it a boss? Oh no. Let's go back outside. I know an entire area that we can hit. So far, I don't think this thing has done anything, but I don't think I've fought enough. Casters? I mean, when I fight them, it's nice and all, but they end up going oom. Um. Oh my god, they hurt so much. Oh. Hmm. That's a lot of enchanters. I gotta run. Ooh, this is gonna be fun. Okay. Um, I lagged. Okay, so it looks like there are two mages here now. Uh, hmm. Are they gonna come this way? Oh boy. My Zanza pot was completely wasted. I wonder if they're gonna think. Where'd they go? Where'd those mobs go? Let's drink while I scout on my druid. I think they're gone. Oh man, I used my thingy too. I did get way overconfident with that fight, to be honest. Not very smart of me. Like at all. I pulled so many enchanters. Oh, oh, sweet. There's no enchanter in here. I think I can take on all these guys with at least one enchanter. Two enchanters in there, I'm not doing that. No, no. One enchanter with two clerics. Oh, hello. Uh-oh. Oh, man, I need this. Not being very smart about my mana. Oh, hello, hello. All right, this is looking good. Wow, I need mana. I mean, these guys dropped some pretty good stuff. It's actually kind of crazy. Oh, how could I forget? I should probably equip this and this. Yeah, more defensive stuff. Let's drink. Man. Yes. Wow, I just really hate enchanters, I'll be honest. Let's kill these guys again. Please don't kill me! Oh. Yes. I wonder if these victims are friendly for more. Oh, sweet. I'm gonna go search for those horde. There's the rogue. Did he die? I think that rogue died. He's just gonna hearth. Okie doke. I'm okay with that. Lose some cheese. The castle is probably the best place just in general to farm. That doesn't have a whole bunch of enchanters and stuff. Okay, I think I can pull a lot here. Ooh, nice. This is perfect. Just a bunch of clerics. Two more enchanters that might be pushing it. I can do it. Oh, baby. Oh, no. Oh, shit. Chili. Okay, this I would definitely not be able to solo. <laughs> I used two entire mana bars. Nice. Primed musket. Hmm. Gather them up a little bit more. 
I can take the stress off my druid with heals for just a little bit because I do have more pots on this guy than I do on that. This is honestly really successful. This is more uncontested than than uh, Western Plug Lands. Hearth Glen is better in general, I would say, um, solely because of the workers. You can just farm the workers and get roughly around the same. I mean, I think these guys have a higher chance of dropping grays, but there are no like normal mobs that I can farm, for instance. Like if there's downtime, like if I'm waiting for this castle to respawn, I can't just go outside and farm some workers. I have to actually wait for them to spawn, which kind of sucks, but you know. If you are a knight, I would suggest picking these up just endlessly. They cost 10 silver. And it's as much as a superior mana potion. Uh oh. Oh my god. So much ring cloth. I found so much. Let's do it. Oh, this is gonna be a nice one. Do I hit him? Yes. Oh boy. Oh boy. Please don't. Please don't. Okay, we're good. I'm gonna take some of the stress off my gear for a little bit. Oh boy, I don't have this on. It's huge. I actually need to use my shadow oil. Hmm. I'll do it next time. Oh yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Another bulky mall. Oh boy. Alright guys, I'm gonna get out of here before these guys murder me. Let's go jump behind this wall. That was quite a bit of fun. That last pull was definitely the most successful one. Thank you so much for watching. I had uh, 15 gold worth of just grays alone. I found about 100 green cloth, actually exactly 100 green cloth. Found this little recipe. I uh, found this green, which vendors for three and a half. Bunch of food, some scrolls of protection. Uh, yeah. Thank you so much, guys.